Fairy Pony, and welcome to episode 9 of Fever's Fan Mail Fun Time! Today I have three new pieces of fan mail to open, and I think I'm going to open up the biggest one first. This one is all the way over from Denmark, and is really quite big and slightly heavy, and it also makes a rattle sound, so I'm very curious as to what's in it. Let's open it up. Okay, let's open up the letter first. Ooh, look, it's what that little adorable mouse. I see that in France when I go there. I forget the name of it, but it's very cute. Hi, Cleo. I'm an 18-year-old girl, and I like MLP too. That's awesome. You know, I always say to my viewers, you're never too old for toys or what makes you happy, and I'm glad to see the other older girls who like My Little Pony just as much as I do. Your stop motion videos are so amazing. Oh, thank you so much. I'm really glad you enjoy them. Keep up the good work. And it doesn't say who it's from. Well, thank you very much, mystery sender. Maybe your name is on something else. Here we have more of that adorable paper and it says stickers on it. Let's open it up. Let's take a look at them one by one. First up, we have these 3D classic Mickey Mouse stickers. How cute are those? Look, there is little Mickey with a bone for Pluto, and look at him. Oh, it's just like the classic cartoons, and there's a soft little sock there. The Courier Journal, look at that. This is so adorable. I've never seen anything quite like that before. And then we have the same style, but with Minnie and Mickey. Look at them. They've got a little picnic. Look at the basket! Look how real that looks! These are fantastic! Look at that little picnic blanket! Look at their adorable little faces! Oh, I love it! Then we have these adorable little Hello Kitty stickers! I can't go over every single one of those, but just look at those pretty colours! She's so adorable! And then last but not least, we have these absolutely fantastic Hello Kitty Zodiac stickers! Look at them! They are just fantastic! Look at the Pisces one too. I am a Pisces, sun sign that is. I love Sagittarius as well. There's Aquarius looking fabulous. And I love little Aries. Those are so adorable. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, last we have this box here, which is full of different little goodies. I think this paper here is just to try and protect it. So that's nothing special. Let's try and get all these paper noodles out. Ah, there we go. Okay, we have a little ceramic doll Kiri, look at her! Oh, she's so pretty, look at her! She's got beautiful curly blonde hair, bright yellow hat, and just the prettiest little white dress. She's lovely! And she's fully poseable as well. Look at that, I don't, ha I don't have any ceramic dolls. Well, I didn't, now I have. And look, here we have another one in this super pretty pink dress. You know, this makes me want to make a dress that looks like this for one of my ponies. Wouldn't that look lovely? So pretty. Oh, they're so adorable. Now there's more things in here if we can get the paper noodles out. Ah, uh, let's get... <gasps> look at that! It's a little fish! And uh, isn't this perfect because I am a Pisces and we're just saying with the stickers. And of course that's the two fish and here is... A little fish. He's not a plushie, but he's actually a little beanie. Look at that! I love the bright colours! Oh, that's adorable! Thank you! Even better, we have a little sea turtle! He's just an amazing bright green colour, and look at his adorable little face! He's all shiny and silvery! I love him! Oh, look, they're going to be best friends! Look how amazing they are! Next up, we have... Hello Kitty Erasers, look! It's Hello Kitty and her sister Mimi and they look so cute! They're in their traditional red and then yellow little, um, I see dungaree outfits, that's what I'll call them. I don't know if they're meant to be dresses. And then we have a little ABC book for them. I feel so guilty actually using these as erasers. Because you feel like you're ruining the little work of art they are. There's also this super adorable eraser here of a little rabbit. I think this might be Sylvania Families, but I'm not sure. That is really cute. Maybe it's Peter Rabbit. I'm, I'm really not sure, but it's very adorable. Now we have this adorable little Kinder Surprise Egg Fluttershy. I don't have this one, and isn't she so adorable? She's so cute. Oh, I love her. She can sit with my Equestria Girls Kinder Surprise Fluttershy. Now there's two versions. And here we have little Kinder Surprise Pinkie Pie looking super adorable. I don't know if this is her stand or maybe it's Fluttershy's, but this is a little stand. There's My Little Pony on, it's bright pink and matches Pinkie Pie's fantastic bubbly hair. Thank you! 
there's also this adorable little eraser house. It's red and white and so cute. I don't know if this goes with the rabbit or the Hello Kitty, but it's also really sweet. Here's another stand for one of the Kinder Surprise ponies. I'll have to try and figure out whose is whose. There's also this little tree eraser here, and I've just figured out, I think it goes into this house here. How cute is that? Lastly, there are these little rubber flowers in red and yellow, and I think they must go with the little kitty cat erasers, the Hello Kitty ones. Thank you so much for all the beautiful gifts. I'm so sorry I haven't got your name anywhere, so I can't thank you by it, but thank you so much, Mystery Sender, nonetheless. Next up, we have this letter all the way over from Australia. See the adorable little stamp? There's nothing in particular on it, so let's just go ahead and open it right up. Oh, hang on, it's nearly there. Here is the letter and it says, Dear MLP Fever slash Cleo, My name's Phoebe and my channel name is My Little Pineapples. I know you, I remember your collab entry in particular, I really liked it. And I've been watching your videos for five months. This letter probably won't get to you on time to be in the Applejack EQ giveaway, but I'll include my address anywhere. Well, you know, you have been entered into another giveaway and I'll explain that giveaway later in this video. The Applejack has already been sent out, but I'll explain which prize you could possibly get at the end of the video. I love watching your videos and you were the inspiration for me to collect My Little Ponies and make my channel about them. Oh, that's so awesome! I'm so glad I've inspired you! You've replied to my comments a few times and even commented on one of my videos and I'd just like to say thank you. Well, thank you very much for watching my videos. I would have liked to send a package, but postage is too expensive. I commented that and you replied. Well, you know, I understand that postage is very expensive, and I love reading your letters anyway. It's about the thought. And here you are in a video, because I open everything on camera anyway. It doesn't matter. You don't have to send expensive gifts. I like reading anything you have to say. Before I end this letter, I'd just like to ask you a few questions. Yes, I like answering questions. Here we go. What is your OC's name? Mine's Pineapple Crush. Now, Pineapple Crush is a really cool name, but mine is called... Spring Sonnet. Two, what made you decide to make your OC an Earth Pony? Now, I'd like to say there was some interesting story behind that, but here is the explanation. I always knew I wanted a custom pony of my OC, and I always knew I wanted it to be pink. But I also knew that I didn't want my pony to be painted, so I thought one day I'll have to use, or have to have someone else use in this case, a Pinkie Pie base. So I had to be an Earth Pony. And that, that is the story. That's it. Also, because not a lot of people choose Earth Ponies. Most people choose Pegasi, I think. So that was a little bit different as well. But there you go, it was mostly about making a custom. That's the big interesting story. I really hope this arrives to you safely and that you enjoy the artwork as well. well I'm sure I will. Bye for now. Love from one of your biggest fans, Phoebe. And there's a little pineapple there. Thank you so much, Phoebe. P.S. What's your favourite song? Mine's is that G by Girls' Generation. You know, I love so many songs. But when I'm editing this, I will put my current favourite song on screen right now. P.P.S. I'm saving up so I can change my first name to Dave and my last name to who lives in a jolly old house. Well, I do hope you're joking there because that's rather a mouthful of a last name. <laughs> so here is one of the little drawings. It says MLP Fever here and there's my OC. She's so cute. I love the way you've done her body all chubby-like and adorable. Look at that, that's so cute. And then we also have this bigger drawing. Look at that, it says MLP Fever in big bubble writing. And there is my littlest pet shop mascot on a cloud. And there's my OC on a cloud! Look how cute that is! That's so adorable! I really love the way you've done my mascot! Look! It's adorable! Thank you! And finally, Phoebe has sent this little Australian five cent coin! Look at it! It's got an echidna on it and it actually has the Queen of England on the back! I didn't know Australian coins had that because this is my very first time ever even seeing an Australian coin! Never mind touching it! Thank you! That's really cool! Last but not least, we have this package from one of my fellow Brits. Let's open it up because there's nothing written on the back, I don't think. Let's open it up. Oh my goodness, there's blind bags in here. Let's open this up first. Uh, try and find the letter. Letters are important. Hi, MLP Fever. My name is Rosie and I'm 10 years old. You and Alice LPS are my favorite YouTubers. Hooray, me and Alice. My favorite video by you is reading hate and weird comments because you replied to my comment and it was so funny. Oh, oh, uh, what comment was that? Uh, 
You'll have to let me know which comment that was. I'm sorry if I was too sassy, but I'm glad you liked the video. Just like you, I collect MLP and LPS, but I also collect Ever After High dolls and Shopkins. Ooh, I love Ever After High dolls. I've actually bought a doll very recently, and you'll see a review of her soon. I love blind bags, and I get excited when I get the ones that I want. Your videos are awesome, and please don't stop. You know, I won't stop. For as long as you guys watch, I won't be stopping making videos. Thank you so much, Rosie. Love Rosie, of course. Sorry, my handwriting is terrible. It's not terrible, it's fine. Here we go, here's a drawing! Look at this! It's my little pet shop mascot and she's enormous! And over here is my My Little Pony OC and it says This child should be called LPS Fever! LPS are the best! And then there's my pony saying, no thanks. Well, I know I do a lot of little pet shop videos, but I don't think I'll ever be changing my channel name. On a serious note, it will say NLP Fever, but with a lot of LPS on the channel. Oh, here's another one of my mascot no see. Here we go. What do you want to review, says my pony. LPS, says the dog, but I want to review MLP. Too bad we're reviewing LPS. You know, sometimes I do kind of have deba debates of myself like that. Well, what am I going to do today? I don't know, because I have so many videos I'm making recently and it's, it's hard to keep track of it all sometimes. Look at that! MLP Fever! Here they are again and it says LP Fever in pink and green writing because those are my favourite colours. Look how adorable that is! Thank you so much for your lovely drawings. You know, I'm so glad you included my little pet shop mascot because she really is just as big a part of MLP Fever as my OC is and they look so cute together. Look! Thank you! Okay, lastly we have four blind bags to open. It's got super pretty wrapping on it. Let's just open up a random one and see what's inside. I have no idea what this could be. Oh, it's a little pet shop swan! Oh, it's so cute! And, and it won't focus. Oh, it's finally in focus. Look at it, I don't have this one. And did you know LPS swans are my favourite LPS? Oh, she's lovely. Thank you so much. Oh, and it turns. Okay, let's open up this flat one. Let's see what we've got. I have no idea. Oh, look! It's a little frozen notepad. It says sisters forever. Look how pretty they look there. Oh, that's adorable. Thank you. Okay, another little one. Maybe it's another LPS. We'll find out. I think this is a... Spinning top. Yeah, I think it might be a spinning top. Oh, look at that! That's really cool! And of course it is shaped like a really adorable little elephant. Thank you! Okay, last we have this really big blind bag. In fact, I wouldn't even call it a blind bag. It's more of a present, isn't it? Oh no, look at that! It's a My Little Pony tin! And on the inside we've got a sheet of stickers! A little castle and stars! Those are so pretty, and look at this! It's got all the main six giving each other a big group hug, and it says, Friendship is magic, it's red and pink. And I don't have anything like that, that's lovely! Thank you so much! Thank you all so much for sending your lovely fan mail, I love it all! Now of course it is time to announce the winner of the giveaway for Coloratura. I've put everybody's, every one of the 15 names through a list randomizer, and the winner is... LPS Snoopy Lover! Congratulations, LPS Snoopy lover! You can send your address to the email address on screen right now, and I'll send out your prize as soon as I can. And the next giveaway is for Sweetie Drops! This is exactly the pony the winner will get, and I am entering 30 people into this giveaway. And that includes Phoebe and Rosie I've opened up the mail of today. So there's 28 places left in the giveaway to win Sweetie Drops. To begin with a chance of winning her, you can send fan mail to the address on screen right now. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a like and subscribe for lots of fun new videos every week. Thanks for watching!